Welcome to another time out with me on the channel. My name is Alec Godwin, if you're here for the first time. Today, it's all about small rig. This episode is not sponsored um, by small rig. I just decided to do this on my own um, I'm going to be doing that with other brands as well, but I'm starting with Small Rig because um, they were able to catch us real good with, with that intimate, you know, use of the cages, you know, like playing with them like Legos. And um, now we are stuck. I think we are stuck because we already love them. If you're here for the first time, you're welcome. Let's take a look. You want to press? Yeah, you want to press. Uh, there's a hook right in there. You want to press it down till it gets to that bottom line. I'm going to have to use my phone for this. I'm going to try to do it with one hand while I record with the other. Ready? I'm press and try to hook. Try to touch the hook. Go down, some more. Come on, almost there. Mm -hmm. Oh, almost. Almost doesn't count. Oh. Ah, we got it. I would love to have a bigger one. A bigger one, a bigger one. Um, don't forget the skirts is there. This is the co control, further control the light and um, depending on the situation you might um, you may or may not need this one okay so that's number one number two okay let's take this one uh, from smurrick and it's the cpl um, 77 so i'm gonna um, test it. We're going to test this in the field actually tomorrow. Aha! The ND filter. I have a small rig mat box. I have, in fact, two small rig mat boxes. Okay. That can take 4x5.65. This is like two stops of NDs. So um, we're going to we're going to see how this looks like. Let's check it out. Okay, here we are. That's a thick one. Wow, the packaging is serious. Like, they know this is for and it's cheap. They are doing so much for, 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 they are doing so much and charging so less than what the other guys are charging yeah go. let's go sideways Let's get the dish out first. Please remove before I use. Lay this aside. Let's see, we got the cables. And the power adapter. Oh, solid. Wow, this is, this got some presence, but not so big, That's not too large. Lay it down. Let's first of all see what's in here. We have the manual, we have some stickers. Handle we care. You might want to stick this on some delicate parts. This is nice. 
a little something to stick on the parts that are delicate if you're shipping or something. That's good. And then we got a belt for the bag. Okay. So let's keep that back in there. So the last but not the least, in fact, the celebrity of the of the show is the chip on board by Smorik. Oh, I love this. You could tell. This is really nice looking. Start small, grow big. Small rig, big dream. Yeah, that's the, that's the motto. Okay, so this can be here. And we're gonna set this up. Um, so we're gonna set it up in another video though. Uh, I just wanted to unbox all, all everything small rig. And so you know what's coming up. So you might might want to subscribe to the channel so you see what goes down with all this. The last item is going to be a giveaway, <coughs> and it's something um, wasn't sponsored by Smorik. The only thing I got from Smorik that was sent to me for review is this ND filter, just to make a review on it. I wasn't paid, so. All these views are mine. I'm not. Uh, it's cheap. It's a hundred and something bucks. I can afford it to buy it on my own. So I won't sell out just because of this. So um, I, I mean, I definitely will give a honest review. Okay. So you want to watch out for for the for the full review. The last item that I'm gonna get is actually the giveaway for today, and it's another product by Smorik. But you gotta wait for it. Correction, we have two two giveaways. Number one is the Black Magic Pocket 6K, the Pocket 6K full cage, and the small rig. The small rig mat box, okay? So this is the one we are gonna mount on and use this filter. There's a wrap in the wrap and a wrap in the wrap. Oh my god, this is really tiny. <laughs> this is like, there's nothing here. <laughs> what you say? I have, uh, I have this filter on now because we're going to need it through the car. The 77, 77 uh, CPL. Um, so I had to put a filter ring before I got this Morig uh, filter on. And so I'm hoping now that I have a 77 in one of these uh, boxes. Uh, the labels. It's inside and we have 95 to 82. 95 to 72. This is 77. Yay! Okay, let's find out what the last one is so we don't just get excited and forget about it showing what's in there um 67 okay perfect so i uh, would um if it wasn't for this stuff we can also mount with this one directly but since we have a filter there and it's a 77 thread we want to put this on okay okay nice 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 that's great 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 okay the last thing we need to see is um it's like a pouch uh, i don't want to bring that out a pouch so okay to put them on if you have to Take them around all right so that's the unboxing for this guy i'll put them back in place whoever is going to win this um i'll arrange them back neatly for you okay uh, by writing the comment below if you are interested okay then i'll make my decision from the interested part participant We are in. Now we tighten. Uh, come on, focus. All 
right. So now we tighten. Okay, this thing is a little bit wobbly. I haven't figured out how to tighten it. Before we go, uh, let's just mount this guy. Okay, so I think we'll have to push this one out. Maybe like, like, I think we have to, let's shut this one for now. Pull this one like a tray, okay? And then insert our filter. So, dip it inside and then pull this one backwards. And there we go, we did it. Now we have to slide it in. Okay, we we'll slide it in. Okay, we're good. Our filter is on. Let's go. Okay, so now we I took off um I took off the polarized filter and I went straight to the sixty-five ring. This is a 65 millimeters, uh, millimeters lens. So I got this, um, the right adapter, the 65 one for it. And I put the mic box out. You see, now it is sturdy. Because you know why? The CPA was designed to rotate. You know, in order to work, it has to rotate. So hopefully you won't need to do a, use a CPA when uh, using the mad box the nd maybe both screw on filters but the nd and the cpl will be screw on uh, filters that, that will probably be the way to go but see how sturdy it is right now it's not flipping it's very sturdy very sturdy and now i'm feeling like i i'm loving it i am loving it ready to go full blown. Oh no. Wow. And this is without any filter at all. Uh, they're all good, but I just wanted to, to show you if there is um, 
there's any color shift if you notice any problem so i'm using the ursa 12k and the internet nd as um, a standard which we all love and like i mean it's very good comparing with the small rig one i think we i think it looks good what you think let me know what you think in the comments below and maybe I'll just do a screen to compare both, um, all three with internal Urso ND, without ND, and with the Smurrig, Smurrig Cine filter. Thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.